morning everyone. Yes, I'm so tired because <laughs> today I'm today we're talking about a weak man. It is mm T A E Kim. Oh boy. <clears throat> Bloomberg Tech uh Bloomberg Tech uh economist uh, whatever that is, I guess. I don't care. Argues food games are still sexist and 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 admits that he's uncomfortable playing uh, uncomfortable playing uh, titles featuring a uh, female character in a skimpy outfit. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, this is the most fun part. Now you boys a little shit. So. The tweet, the tweet has fired, fired back against the Bloomberg, um, against Bloomberg, who, uh, who, who's not against all games is, uh, is so sexist. Uh, but the issue is what would be the like by diversity. Okay, you dipshit, not need to be fixed by diversity and shit. And then, then there was an article on Bloomberg. <laughs> okay, the Bloom. Okay, the, uh, Bloomberg. Bloomberg, uh, article by Kim. I want to smack this little bitch. <laughs> would 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 he would he argue that video game the video game industry uh, struggles with struggles struggles with the struggle with the shake the shakes a uh, sexism uh attitudes. First of all, you little shithead. It's a fucking game on our real life. Oh uh, boy. You see what I mean? People like you are so dumb. You're like, wah, wah, wah. I don't like games because, because they're too sexy or they're so characters in skimpy outfits. It's a game. Not for life, you little shithead. And then he cry when he get ratioed, and and he did get ratioed to hell. It was like December, well, December twenty seventh, so not so like not long ago, basically. Okay, the tweet, um, his tweet on December twenty seventh, two thousand twenty one, with uh, with over what well, with over with over seven hundred and twenty five read uh cool tweets. Uh, 30, 37 retweets um, and 173 likes. <laughs> wow, you got reach you to hell. I don't blame you, you dipshit. Hello, hey, give me an entry. Do you have a minute? It's time to grow up. Uh, a very game is really uh, wait, what the fuck? Priority. <laughs> this dipshit thinks, oh, we know what these gun hammers. <laughs> Video games don't don't rely on cringe. Um, okay, you think it's cringe because it because because there's a female character who is scampy and stuff like that wearing scampy outfits. So what? That's part of the gameplay. Let it happen. You're just too soft to say, well or whatever, including including uh, portrayals. Yeah, portrayals, but. But similar, but similar gender tropes of this dipshit is dumb as fuck now. I am not gonna lie. I'll, I'll put the article in the in, in the description, okay? Uh, and, and differences to use over like characters to turn turn on. Far too often. Okay, no, that's not true. Bayonetta was made by a man, and a lot of men talked about it. Women liked that too. They liked Bayonetta. <clears throat> okay. 
Kim Kim begins his opinion. Oh boy, when you when you hear someone say, "Oh, my opinion matters," and your doesn't, you know you want to smack him in the skull with your fucking toe. <clears throat> his opinion piece with with the claims that that the the video game business has has long has has long and troubled history of sexism and. Uh, and gender stereotypes. His supporters, by points, uh, are included by uh, by B by Bungie or Bis BlizzCon 2000 2010, or or a female activist, or a female fan, uh, acts Activision Blizzard. If if we could have some time, the World World of Warcraft. Uh, uh, characters that doesn't look, they only slip on to Victoria's Secret Victoria's Secret catalog. Okay, there's a lot of sort of wrong with this. And and it's right there. Well, I don't know if I go into it. The entire thing between <laughs> between a lawsuit between uh, some of the employees, Activision, Blizzard, and a lot of stuff going on there. I'm not really getting into it, but I'm gonna talk about Cam because he's a little shithead. Horizon Zero, yada yada, notes in 2017 sold over 3.4 million units, and the game has only listed on supermodel women. Okay. This little shit doesn't... Okay, the character look how they want. It doesn't matter what you think. It's a game, though. If it's a game, it's a game. It doesn't say them men for men or women. Men still play female games. And yet again, those don't cry about the character being over-sexualized or their gender. Well, they don't care. We'll just play the game. Let's save... Uh, let me get a game quick, okay? Okay. Final Fantasy 13. Yeah, they just released it for the Xbox One. You play as a female character. You can change them out for men and women. It's a good game though. And I have both. I have Final Fantasy 13 and 13 2. Yeah, this is a weird title. But you play as a female character and she's not over sexualized. So what you cry over? It's too sexual. No, you're just too soft. You're too soft to, to say that gaming is for everyone and not to over -sertilize. Yes, at times it is, but that's how it is. Deal with it. And you talk about Bayonetta being uh, being created by women, but in reality it was made by men. Made by men. For men. And yet that's fine. Women so like it. A lot of people rather have a sexy character than an ugly one. The latest uh, Horizon game... Uh, Forbidden West, I think it's called. Oh no, I haven't looked into it. It's, they made her cheeky more chubbier. Holy shit, they're not that good looking. Uh, yeah, coming out this year, well. And the type of Bayonetta, uh, magic hair, ships, and yada yada drops. Tomb Raider, he talked about. It is, it's a sex object. Uh, <sighs> well, no wonder. Got an impact. Uh, he talks about uh some game from two thousand twelve, uh, Last of Us Part Two, where it's an evil. Let me find that one tweet that he talked about. Uh, then you t then you talked about playing Tomb Raider. I I I found I found it uncomfortable playing a lead tile like Tomb Raider. Got an impact. Being at um, including skimpy outfits. <clears throat> oh boy. There's a whole hell of a lot. Uh, I'll put the, put the tweet in the description, or the link of it, uh, so you can read it for yourself. Uh, thank you, like and subscribe, yeah.